So you want to live in Italy and you can't get residency, there's a solution. And for that matter, if it's Germany, Switzerland, or anywhere in that awful Schengen zone. France. France even. We've got the solution. You can't get residency, you want to live somewhere in Europe, stick around and we're going to tell you how to do it. Come along. Hey everyone, welcome back. It's Warren and Julie. If it's your first time joining us, we're a couple of early retirement travelers. We're living a slow travel nomad expat life in Europe with our dogs. We try to share our experiences and expenses and provide insight to what life is like abroad through our YouTube channel and website, warrenjulietravel.com. So if you haven't already, please subscribe and don't forget to join our nomad expat community on Facebook. Just search Warren Julie Travel. So let's talk about the Italy residency dream. A lot of people dream of living in Italy, whether it's the mountains in the north near Lake Como, the vineyards of Tuscany, the beaches of Rimini, or spending time in the canals of Venice. But the residency rules for Italy are quite esoteric and open to interpretation of the day. It seems many people want to have residency in Italy, but for one reason or another, find themselves unable to get it even after potentially purchasing a home and qualifying for the very vague rules. So if you want to live in Italy and have your dream of living in Europe, there is a simple solution. Italy being part of the Schengen area allows visitors from many countries to stay for up to 90 days within a 180 day period without needing the visa. This makes it perfect for a short term adventure However, if you're looking for a longer stay, things can get a bit more tricky. Because Italy is part of the Schengen zone, your time in the entire zone is limited and your time in Italy counts as your time in the Schengen zone. And the Schengen zone limits you to 90 days every 180 days. So when you're in Italy, those same days are counting for the rest of those 29 countries. So the best way to think of the Schengen it's a collective of 29 countries, and it's to imagine it as one country. You cannot go into these additional countries after 90 days, so you must leave the zone. You must be out of Schengen for 90 days before you're allowed to re-enter. This means you cannot go to Switzerland, France, Austria, Slovenia, or any of the others in this 29 country list, but fear not. Albania is here to save the day. Woohoo! So there are several direct ferry options in Italy that go directly to Albania that you can get and spend 90 days plus in. So a great example of this is if you had a budget and you wanted to buy a home in Italy of $250,000, you can easily afford to buy a property in Italy and Albania and have a home in each location and shuttle back and forth. We just covered one euro homes that were for sale in Musameli, and that's located in Sicily, so check out that video if you haven't. So perhaps you wanna buy a home in that, in that region or somewhere else in Italy because there's a lot of these types of programs out there as well as housing in Italy is actually quite affordable because of its shrinking population. But still, residency is a hurdle. So there are many regions that you can consider for these low cost programs throughout the country. You can easily rent a home in Saranda or Tirana or one of the other Albanian cities for under $600 per month, utilities included, if you prefer not to buy a home in both countries. Keep in mind that the summer on the Albanian Riviera, rental prices increase dramatically. Perhaps you may want to spend your spring and your autumn in Albania and your winter and your summer in Italy. Because there is an extensive network of trains and other modes of public transportation, this could work from other areas of Europe as well. There is only one border crossing into Albania. So as you're traveling through Europe, you can go straight from Germany to Albania and only break out your passport one time when you get off the ferry. So it's very simple as a foot passenger to get from Italy into Albania off of a train and then go anywhere you want into Albania either by bus or taxi. 
Italy and Albania offer unique opportunities for travelers whether you're on short-term vacation or looking to stay a bit longer. Albania is not part of the Schengen area, but it has its own charm and perks for travelers. For many nationalities, Albania offers visa-free entry for up to 90 days within a 180-day period, just like Italy and the Schengen. However, for American citizens, it's better. The U.S. passport enables a traveler to stay in Albania for 360 consecutive days without a visa. Reminder, that's for the American traveler. Plus, the cost of living in Albania is relatively low, making it an attractive option for digital nomads, long-term travelers, and slow travelers. From the vibrant streets of Tirana to the stunning beaches along the Albanian Riviera, there's so much to see and experience. And the best part? You can extend your stay in Albania without jumping through too many hoops. You know, it's essential to check visa requirements and regulations for your specific nationality before making any travel plans. Much of what we're speaking about today is focused towards the American. So remember to always respect the laws and regulations of the countries that you're planning to live in or visit. Whether you are exploring the historic streets of Italy, soaking up the sun in Albania, or mastering the Schengen Shuffle, there's a world of adventure waiting for you. Don't let residency requirements hold you back. Get out there and explore. We hope this is a lot clearer to you now. Don't be intimidated by the Schengen. If you want to live in Italy, Germany, or any other country in the Schengen for that matter. If you're dreaming of France. Yes, Albania is going to give you the option to be able to split time in a nice affordable location in Europe while you're outside of the country that maybe is your primary choice. But don't think of Albania as a second choice. So anyhow, we hope that you like this video, that you're going to subscribe, give the video a like, share with somebody that it might matter to. And until next time, have a great day, everybody. Bye-bye. Ciao.